Hello, hello, everybody! Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I'm here. I'm here. I'm tired, but I'm here. <laughs> I'm tired, but I'm here. And hello, creation! Good morning, and I was catching up on what I missed with Arcadia yesterday. Oh, yeah. Arcadia was a wild ride. <laughs> Arcadia was quite the wild ride at the end there. It was a good time. Definitely if you guys did not watch it, the American Arcadia was real good. If you want to like play it, go play it. That was such a good game. That was a 10 out of 10 in my book. <laughs> I had a lot of fun. All right. So off screen, I did try to sell some more stuff that I could in town <laughs> and pretty much everyone ran out of money <laughs> so I wasn't able to really do much more selling but there um, but as we remember right before we ended stream last time we came here and realized that um, the guy was gone and that it definitely seemed like uh, she probably killed him. So actually, when you come and talk to... Oh, you can get on the roof? I didn't realize that. What does that lead to? Also, I'm just waiting for everything to load. Is it gonna load? Okay, there it goes. I was like patiently waiting for everything to load. <laughs> Uh, I, I, I ran into another weird little comment section here when I was tr when I was selling stuff. Gildra? Oh, no, just you again. How can I help you? Um, yeah, you should know that uh, Gildra's not coming back. What? Don't joke about that. He'll come back. He always does. He's probably just gone to get more coal for the forge or visit one of the ore mines. Sure. Uh, not for you to worry about in any case. <laughs> You're a customer. Is there anything I can do for you? Oh, he's dead. And no obituary in the Gazette? Impossible. I don't know why you're insisting on spreading these nasty thoughts, but I'll ask you to kindly keep them to yourself. Now, is there anything you'd like to buy? If not, move along. Okay. But did you not, did you not see the big blood pile? Big blood pile over here. A lot of blood, man. Can I actually climb to the roof? Is there anything on the roof? Is there a reason to climb to the roof? <laughs> Probably isn't any reason to climb to the roof, but it's gonna let me. Is there anything over here anywhere? Probably just like a way to get around if you wanted to. Doesn't look like there's anything good up here. Oh, we could get down over here. Alright. Well, we never did find all of pieces of dribbles, but it might be fine. I don't know if you can find more pieces of him in, like, actual Boulder's Gate, or if it's only here. But there might be places that we just didn't look. Something good here, I hope. Ooh. Stuff to loot. Something's on my mind. Achoo! Oh, bloody dogs! Yeah. That was 
allergic to dogs and stuck in front of here. Um, is there anything new? You again? You're becoming a bit of a regular, aren't you? Not complaining, not complaining. So, you'll be wanting a copy of today's edition of the Boulder's Mouth Gazette then. Yeah, it seems to be like you're the one that likes nasty news. I like making sales. Not my fault, it's the nasty stuff that sells. You want one or not? I assume that if it says two, that Shame. means well, that's there's the one tomorrow. I already got. Like, that's the one I already got. I'm guessing. Is it saying it oh, will give me a second one? Alright. Oh, look at all the stock that they left over here. Is this all the stuff they've taken off of people? Alright. But I guess we are- we get to wander into Baldur's Gate now. I'm not taking Raphael still. I decided not to. This is me with to get back over here. This isn't a quicker way, was there? Okay, no, we had not gotten a teleporter yet. Yeah, 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 we know. We know. He wants to talk to us. Here goes nothing. Okay, is this into talking to him? Okay, well, there's the waypoint. Interesting. Uh, can we talk to anybody? You heard anything about what it's like in the prisons? <laughs> Actually, don't tell me. I don't want to know. Are they going to arrest us? It's a waiting that's hard. If we could just talk to one of the fists, it would be as clear as day that we're not criminals. Hmm. Let's rehearse this to I ain't saying nothing to nobody until I've had my trial. So these are all people who are on trial. No time or something? to talk. I have clients to brief, and they're as sharp as spoons. Oh, leave it out. I've got a trial coming up, and I need to rememberize my lines. <laughs> I need to memorize my lines. Yep, mm-hmm. Let's rehearse this one you can see enough ages, and we're still Pretend here. I'm a fist. What are they waiting for? They say Gortash won't be king, but that pomp upstairs sure sounds like a coronation. <laughs> Hello. This is the armory, not a bloody open house. Fists only. Now clear off. Okay. Oh, I'd like to trade with you. Trade? Do I look like a shopkeeper? I don't this know, do you? equipment isn't for sale. It belongs to the Flaming Fist. Um... Uh... Oh, nice. My Rapture thing actually gives me some help with this stuff, too. Try persuasion? Sure, we'll, we'll save just in case, though. Did badly no matter what. I'm Darn not it. interested. Now get out. I've got work to do. But what if you have something good? Oi! I told you already! Flaming fists only! Boo! Oh, what if I ran- what if I lost out on something deliciously great? 
What if we, hold on, what if we go back? What if we, we saved, we saved, we'll go back. We'll try again, something else, different maybe. I just wanna see what you sell. What if there's something amazing in this? <laughs> Me reloading on something dumb, like trying to get someone to be a vendor. <laughs> Loading screen takes forever at the very beginning. I feel like it always takes even longer. But I know this zone is like really hard to load. Trade? Do I look like a shopkeeper? This equipment isn't for sale. It belongs to the Flaming Fist. Yeah, maybe let's read her thoughts. Oh! You're pretty good there, actually. Can't believe they put that mindless metal Mragresham in my armory. Steel watchers. Stupid thing will probably decapitate me for cleaning the bloody mace rack. Oh, so much would be uneasy. A good weapon in my palm would put my mind at rest. Finally, someone <laughs> who sees sense. Strong folk wielding strong blades. That's what keeps folk safe. Not those glorified golems. Yes. I don't have anything fancy, but I are welcome to take a look. Nice. Yeah, it doesn't really have anything fancy. Play chain armor. Rare heavy armor. Um. That's light armor. Yeah, I don't think any of these are better than what I have. Hi, Chris. How's it going? Stay sharp, stranger. In these times, we're going to see none of that to any blades in our for hands. us for now. I'm going to have Puck here to yell at me saying that I, I'm, I'm dumb and I, I'm not grabbing things. Report of several little... Mountainhead pursuant to an investigative order of the Blaze Larry Fortier. A cross index of pointing similar and unsolved murders in Boulder's Gate leads to an inescapable conclusion that we are witnessing the resurgence of the cult of the murder god Ball. As the textbook tells us, over a hundred years ago during the 1360s, the criminal organization known as the Iron Throne was taken over by a brutal new leader, Zervok, um, and Chev, this servak proved to be what is called a ball spawn. The powers granted by his semi-divine blood, he nearly brought ruin to the entire city before his defeat by the hero known as the Gorian, Gorian's Ward. After that, the Iron Throne was brought down, the ball temple was pressed, and the murder cult receded into the background. Now, however, corpses that bear the hallmark Abolished murders are once again being discovered in Baldergate Street. Several pretender at the rate is increasing. Citizens are anxious, some verge on panic, and the proud flaming fist corpse, which usually depend on shows of force to discourage criminal criminal well criminal words today. Activities now find our usual methods unsuccessful. The location of the old ball temple in the ruins of the undercity has now been lost, so a raid is out of the question. Recommendations. A ball murder response force should be organized as soon as the feasible to provide the visible reaction to cultist incursions in the lower city. Yeah. Hmm. 
I've been sitting here for 20 minutes wanting to say hello and goodbye before going to work. It turns out I needed to refresh the stream. Oh no! <laughs> well, hello and goodbye. I hope work's not too much of a pain. Yeah, they're not going to have much luck with the whole ball thing because the person in charge of that the flaming fist don't stand for trouble. Is literally working so with the guy. Here, yeah? <laughs> okay, can I come up? I don't want to go down that hall just yet. You won't let me have them? Nope. It's biting me. It's fine, I'm just accidentally pointing at things. Don't mind me. I ain't doing anything. Oh god, I'm in the wall. Oh, what's over here? Oh, it's wanted posters. Can I look at them? No? No? Nothing? See, they're broken or there actually really isn't anything there. Okay. Normally they let you read them. Let's see what this does. Ah, huh. must be broken. It's not like them to have something like that and then not have it actually say anything when you click on it. It likes to break a lot. All right, we know that he's over there. I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing that right. Oh, wait, why is it saving? Hells, not this again. Oh, it's the... Without all three stones to control it, it will soon start acting on its own will. Okay, I hear ya. Oh, this is the audience hall, though. Uh... Ms. Aura, what are you doing in here? Is this the audience hall? Okay, the audience hall is in there. Okay. If it oh. isn't Little Will's chums! I hope he hasn't been too much trouble. Heard about his father. The Dead Three's puppet. A travesty, really. He's upstairs in Worm's Rock, ordaining Gortash as Archduke. A splendid shindig, I hear. Perfect for crashing. Go on up. We'll talk after. And bring the pup along, if you can. I'd hate for him to miss the fun. Oh, but that would require me to level him up. Oh, shit, I didn't think about that. Am I gonna have to finally level him up? You hear? Milady says Absolute's army's on the march. There's watchers. We'll hold the line. You best believe. Cult army on the march. Killer on the loose. And Mistress Dorenbold still drags me hither. And thither. Okay. I should speak up. Head up, chest out. Lord Portier could descend any moment. Okay, so these are all the bodyguards of all the higher ups Lord, that are up there. Archduke, God. <laughs> I'll call Gortash what he wants. As long as Lord Chatshield pays me for all this waiting around. Uh, okay. Sorry, sorry, these dukes are working me to the bone. Hello. You're the cook. Bruff's babbling, no time to talk. No, nope. you won't talk to me. Oh, everything is considered stealable. <sighs> Can't make off with anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What if I don't? What if I continue to look around instead because I'm scared? Can I actually physically talk to her? Go on up. Pay Gortash a visit. A fate to remember. I guarantee. Okay. <sighs> I don't want to talk to... Master Porter, I've taken the liberty of... Oh, 
You are not the master. Just as well. Okay. Oh boy. All right, so the attendant hall is there. Wait, I'm confused. There's a thing here. Lord Gortash is expecting you. Please make your way to the audience chamber. What's this? What's this way? If that's the audience hall over there, what's this way? Oh, the prison. Oh, he's asleep. God is fast asleep. Bathed in a ten day. Eat all the onions. Yeah, listen, listen to what, what, what are you talking about? What, what are you talking about? Oh damn, I really wanted to know. <laughs> oh man, not all. Back here again. Cell stinks like an old cabbage. Three bowls of this do. Excuse me. What now? <gasps> Goodness, how embarrassing! <laughs> I had a heavy lunch. Welcome to Worms Rock Prison, the fifth nail we jail. What's your business? Yeah, I'm here to see old man Otto. Your father? Hmm. Not much of a family resemblance. Well... That smile. Second cell on the right. And you tell him, no seconds for supper. This here's a prison, not an inn. Hang nice. on, I'll let you through. Nice! Now we can get into the well, prison. Well, you go. And don't feed the prisoners. Okay. Don't mind me as I look around. Alright, there is one person in here. On your way. May Lord Gortash provide. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm just looking around. Can't go in the storage room. Okay. All the fists are down here. Huh? Okay, we got a whole bunch of fists here. I'm not paid to chat. Yeah, but you're not. You're just sitting around anyway. Stay on my good side. Yeah. 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 I promise. I'm definitely not gonna accidentally murder all of you for some reason. Okay. There's two people back here. See who? Hello, who are you? Okay, so that's Otto. Hello. What do you want? Yeah, not your attitude, that's for certain. <laughs> You're the one pestering old men in cages. Now scram with your sour puss. You're disturbing my sitting time. Okay, so that's all. And who's this? Oh, wait a second. Aren't you that lady we saved? You're too late. It's over. What happened? And yeah, what happened to you? The Steel Watch happened. I came seeking allies to our cause. Watchers spotted me. Dragged me to Alder Ravenguard's husk. Empty as a stare. A tadpole's puppet. Nothing more. He spoke in accusations. Apostasy. Conspiracy. Sedition. I'll be executed in five dawns. Oh no! 
cool. After all that work to save you. Um, well, is that all? Well, good luck then. <laughs> uh, I think I'm gonna get you out so we can beat some sense into you. No, I don't you know, maybe persuasion. Ooh, this is a hard one though. Oh, it's a 10, Never mind. it wasn't a hard one. I can read. When the people need a miracle, you cannot wait for the gods to answer. Old as words. I'd almost forgotten. No more sulking. I know what to do. Okay. Unlock my cell. Escort me out of Worm's Rock. I'll seek out my connections. When the city streets shatter, you'll want their blades. Agreed. I will find a way. Hurry. Okay. All right, Otto. Do you have any information for oh, me? For Baldurand's sake, leave an old man <laughs> in peace. Yeah, I'm done being mean to you. Oh no. Okay, it's fine. When I save her, I'll I'll save you too. Anyone in here? came in? Yeah, that's how we came in. Oh, can I look at the prison log? Uh, treason, sedition, and choice mode discount. Detained, awaiting execution. Did I talk to her at all? No treason or crime in down there. We run a tight ship. Okay. If I just if I just knock everyone out in the prison, is that gonna get me in trouble up top? What's in the storage room? The flick of the wrist. If I do, okay. One immediately start looting things. I'm unable to help myself. Sign on the top of that. Oh, well, fancy. Can I like jump up here? So we have a wall that's messed up here. Interesting. 
examine. Force. La, da, da, da. Good question. What you got on right now? Got the piercing. Um, I kept the thing on you, didn't I? Yeah. Okay. Curious. Let's save just in case this causes a horrible thing to happen. Um, can you attack that? Your wound of holding damage. Damn it. Didn't say it was. It's slashing immunity. Oh no, it is it is working. Okay. Okay. Saddle up. Where does this lead us? Is this how we get her out? Dead body right there, though. What to do? On my way. Maybe okay. I need more pockets. Where does this take us? Like, I'll jump up here just to look. The dragon egg. Okay, so, okay. I kind of see where we are. down please we're exploring oh does this not exist over here oh no we can't jump up <laughs> there's a ship there's a ship down there There we go. I was like, why wouldn't let me pick this up? Guess I'm not allowed to pick that up. Alright, there's a ladder. Where does this take me? really takes you up. Where the heck am I? Well, definitely if I open this door, I think he's going to be mad and try to fight me. Did he leave the room? Oh, shoot. There's two of them. Okay. Interesting. Not sure what that does for us, but I guess we'll um we'll head down for now. We'll finish exploring outside. I'm unsure if we just to be saving the counselor and stuff immediately, or... Um, yeah, I'd like to come down. 
Hopefully I can get back up afterwards. <laughs> Okay, we can go this way. Um, uh, can't look like I can't go this way. Cause that's just water. There's a random boat here. That's curious. Ooh, nice. Open that up. Arrow of Arcane Interference. Oh, interesting. Let me grab this, please. Something over there. Mouse hole into the cells. I'm way too big. Interesting. Well, obviously that's not going to help us any. We cannot turn into a mouse. So a mouse hole is not going to help us any. <laughs> I'll grab those two. Not that I ever make potions, but you know. Alright. Jumpy jumpy! All right, all of them followed me up. Good, good, good. Yeah, back up we go. Okay, so that's a way. I am, I am not someone that can turn into a mouse, so I can't do that. But we did find like a, a way out that's not through the front, which is nice. Okay. Oh! Hold up. Oh, oh gosh. Eh. Nope. I want to see where I am. There's a body. A rusty key. Doesn't tell me what the key is for, though. Okay. Well, that sure leads to nothing. All right, and we're back here. We looped our way around. Hmm, interesting. There's another path over here. Where does this lead me? Nowhere. Nowhere it seems like. Okay. I'm unsure why this exists then. There's nothing we can do here. Alright, well, back we go. Yeah, back over here, please. Whee! Alright, all of you, can you please make your way back over here? Let's go in. Let's get going. Come on. Don't get yourself stuck over there. If not over, then through. All right. Come on, let's, let's go. Let's get over here. Is that blood? No, okay, there we go. Light on my feet. Right. Down. Oh, there's like a little 
kayaky thing here. A little boat. Don't look like it's doing very well. <laughs> Oops. Which is funny because I had the key. I used the key. So why would the trap go off if I use the key? <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure that between the guards, the arrow, and the jugged thunderbolt, you'll never survive reading this note. But just in case, I want you to know that you did to deserve all of this. So you should have been stuck in the leg. You turned on me. That's why. Yeah. That must have been this guy. He's got an arrow stuck in him. Let's get on with it. Sweet. <laughs> <Yippee. laughs> nice Let's just here. heal ourselves real quick. Um, I'm gonna just accidentally try to blow myself up. As one does, you know, every once in a while. Just decide to blow your- try to blow yourself up. a little better. How much further can I go? Alright, well that was something. Is there anything else here? Just plants. It was oh no, they're just grass. Oops, oh that was me. I just I just I just tinged I tanged a thing. Okay. <laughs> All right. Seems simple enough. Okay, let's jump over. So we have a way of getting her out. Always at your side. No, oh, don't. Oh, okay, we're gonna talk to people. I don't want to talk to people. Not, not what I wanted to do. Thank you. Oh wait, is he? It's fine. Oh, he's not paying attention. It's fine. Um. I'll just close this door real quick. Nope. Oh, hey, you. Didn't didn't want to didn't want to talk to you. Not what I was trying to do. Okay. What if I could pickpocket him? He's too fast. At the ready. I assume even if I pickpocket him, it's going to give me troubles. I get in trouble if I This calls for careful footwork. 
Wait. Oh, it worked. Okay, he does have keys. Night on my feet. What if? What if we just knock him unconscious? Um. Wanna dance? Oh, let's get the correct weapon back on. Is everyone going to hear if we attack him over here? <laughs> Come on, Karlak. Show him who you are. You were witnessed assaulting someone. You're headed for the cells. Attack him. Oh, nope, they were pulled in. All right, Karlak, it's go time. <laughs> Knees high. Shh, it's fine. I can't even catch my breath. Can't slow down. Okay, so these other two do, do hear it. Double. In striking okay, distance. Come over here. They're gonna come over. All right. On my way. Oh yeah, that did a nice big damage. Nice big damage. Thank you. No. Oh, I didn't mean to hit that one. I wanted to hit a lower one. Oh, it's fine. He, it went off anyways. Okay. Can I see? Okay. May the gods take you first. This is gonna feel good. Oh, I forgot I could rage. It's been a bit since we actually fought. <laughs> oh, shoot. Didn't actually want to kill him. At stopping the heels, damn it. So let's just... At least then he won't be healing anymore. Like, I was trying to be nice and not accidentally murder you guys, but... Oops!
My bad. To be honest, I don't care too much. I was trying to be good and not murder people. But you know, if it happens, it happens. And thank you for the hydrate, the stretch, and the love, Charmy. Hello. Okay, I will stretch. Ugh, I will stretch and I will drink. I will have a drink. And I will loot. Thank you. Okay. Better not be cursed. Now I can loot everything. Hehehe. <laughs> Seems like a good moment to talk. Oh, for Balderan's sake, leave an old man in peace. Okay. I was gonna save you, but okay. Hello. Keep focused. We can talk once I'm free. Oh, okay. Very well, let's get you to safety. All these things had nothing in them. Got excited for no reason. Wish I had a bag of holding. Okay. What's inside? I don't want to talk to you. I'm trying to lose things. Anything useful? I feel like notes are weird things. I'm just be curious, you know, any weird things to look at. Also, if it means that the keys get used and disappear, then that's kind of nice. Truler Gortesh of Arvi Manifor by Vance Fornal. Interesting. That's another person that. Alright. Hmm. What a charmer. Uh Easy. This might kill him, but I just need him out of the way. Yep, it killed him. Um For me. I just want to put their bodies out of the way. <laughs> so I'm unsure what's going to happen the moment I open that door. I guess this is the only guy that gets to stay alive. Have a lot on my mind. And, well, All right. it. This way. Moving in. Oh, am I slowed? Go 
gosh darn it. Okay, hold on. Um. Yeah, listen. What is so heavy? The money? Is it my amount of keys? Shouldn't be. Doesn't look like it. The keys really barely weigh anything. Hmm. Oh, it's this. I don't know. I just have too much stuff on me somehow. I'm just really bad off when it comes to my weight. Da -da 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 -da. Over this way. Okay. This is far enough. The way should be clear. I can't thank you enough for getting me out of that damned prison. And for yeah, giving we me did courage it. when I'd all but run out. All right, we pulled her out. I can thank you, Duff, uh, for getting me out of that damn prison. You're welcome. At least I could do. You've proven to be a vital ally. Yeah. When the flames roared loudest, you pulled me to safety. Most would have let me burn. I won't forget it. I will travel to the upper city. Find what allies I can. You won't fight the coming battle alone. As long as the city stands, I will stand with it. This is my promise. Cool. Let's see. Yay! We've, we saved another ally. We've had to save her, what, twice now? What's in here? Now here's the question. Can I go out the door? Am I safe? If I open this door, is she gonna immediately try to murder me? Oh no, she don't have a clue what happened. Beautiful. Beautiful. No crazy or criming down there. Yeah, yeah. You run a yeah. tight ship. A very tight ship. Um, nothing happened down there. Don't worry about it. Not a thing happened. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> we did it. We saved another person. Yeah. Okay. I'm scared to go to the tending hall. That's probably what I need to do. Yeah, I know. But I don't know if it's safe to go do that. Okay, so this is the new recruit book. Very well. What you what? doing? Oh, uh, what are you? What are you doing in here? I don't know. Just what are you nice. doing? Slip a lockpick into his pocket. Yeah. What are you doing? You're not a fist. Go on, get out, or I'll, I'll wake the others. Yeah, yeah, sure, and I'll, I'll tell them you were trying to steal their belongings. Let's see, hopefully this will do. Oh yeah, we got this. Oh wow, it tried to really make it difficult for us. I'm no thief. I I was going to pay it back. Eventually. I just 
I needed the gold. Needed it for what? I'm getting out of here. Taking a ferry down the coast to get me home. Those bloody crooks at the docks are charging triple, though. Danger money. It's a joke. Yeah, they do got a point. It is dangerous to be Not traveling right boat. now. It's the army marching towards us that makes things dangerous. My wife said we have to stand and fight and... And I can't. I won't. I'm not made for this. Hey, you seem capable. I'm not a soldier. I only joined for the uniform and a warm bed. They're better off without me. I'm scared. All I want is to go home. Aww. You shouldn't be in here. This barracks is private. Oh, can I not give him money now? Well, now I feel bad. Oh, I like how they all have what their chests are. shouldn't be in here. Yeah, I guess I can't. This barracks is private. I'm not allowed to talk to him now. Oh, thank you for the the love nerf. What is she showing up over here for? You're going to get mad at me because I'm not going to go talk to him. Go on up. Pay Gortash yep. a visit. A fate to remember. I guarantee. Okay, fine. I'm guessing that's to tell you that no, you should be going and doing the thing. Go and do the thing. I don't. Lord Gortash is expecting you. Please make your keep those feet moving. Okay. What if I don't want to go meet him, though? What if I'm scared? <laughs> Flaming Fist Barracks. Authorized personnel only. Okay, fine. Alright, well, we went into the prison. We did that. Fine, 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 fine. Mommy Demon, yep. Mommy Demon just keeps popping back up. She's like, hello, go do the thing that you're supposed to go do. And I'm like, ah. I have a feeling this is going to be bad for me. I don't want to do it. Fine. Oh, goody. Yeah, this is going to go totally great for me. Kins people, Baldurians, and dearest Duke Ravengar. Thank you for joining me on this exceptional day. It's him, Gortash. <sighs> this is it. I can practically taste his blood from here. The tiefling is letting her passions get the better of her. The situation is delicate. Do not be swept up in her emotions. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's wait for a more opportune moment. I don't want to put you in harm's way either. I'll wait for now. But that prick is going to pay. A moment, please, my friends. An old acquaintance has come to pay her respects. Please, Carlac, come and say a proper hello. My respects! You're lucky I've agreed not to shove my boot up your... Ah, how I've <laughs> missed your colorful turns of phrase. We must catch up just as soon as I've had words with your little friend. 
As for you, I understand congratulations are in order. Thorm's defeat hasn't gone unnoticed. You're known for who you are and for that netherstone that you carry. The quakes are a clear warning. If nobody steps in soon, it'll free itself from the authority of the crown. I expect it'll start with turning the sword coasts infected. You among them. A prism of yours won't last indefinitely. Next, the grand design. The Mind Flayer Empire reborn. If we're lucky, we'll become slaves. If we're unlucky, well, not the most thrilling of prospects, but it's a fate that can be avoided. If you and I come to an understanding, together we can still restore authority over the brain. Of course. Gortash always did have an eye for opportunity. Yeah, why is the why is the crown failing, huh? It's not. But it will not follow new orders unless the Netherstones are united to give the command. When it finishes executing its current orders, it will be free to do as it wishes. That will be bad for everyone. Once it is freed from its shackles, I doubt we'll ever be able to bring it under control again. Yeah, what kind of understanding do you suggest? There's an old wisdom. A brittle alliance can never be mended. It can only break. With Ketherick gone, Orin proved treacherous. Baal's chosen wants the Neverstones for herself. She only cares for blood. And your blood and mine are of particular interest to her. All right. What are you getting at? Orin changes shape faster than you and I change clothes. You know. She's tricked you before. She's targeted me as well. I'm well protected, but she's extremely good at what she does. If Orin obtains all three netherstones, she'll plunge the coast into chaos and paint the city in blood. I can't let that happen. I want to lead this city to glory, not scorch its earth. Yeah, you want me to believe you? No harm to the city, huh? I'd like to propose a pact. A divine oath sworn upon spirit and flesh. I do no harm to you, nor you to me. Furthermore, you'll have nothing to fear from my steel watch while our pact stands. Thorm's stone is yours to keep. When you slay Orin and take her stone, you bring it here. So the three are united once again. Together we rule Faerun as kings. No, more than kings. Gods. We rule as the absolute. What do you say? Shall we be allies? I can detect no deceit. This alliance could serve us well. And if it does not, well, we need not honor it. Hmm. Let's be allies, said the viper to the frog. Um... Insight. Interesting. Well, I assume he's just really good at holding himself, so we're not gonna really learn much, but... Oh, we're gonna do badly anyway, so it's fine. <laughs> we can gleam nothing because we are bad at this. You look carefully, but discover nothing. <laughs> As it happens. Yeah, it seems like none of you can be trusted. So Kethrick was ready to betray our alliance too. I can't say it comes as a surprise, but you should know this. I initiated this plot. I brought Kethrick and Orin together to create the absolute. They knew this would only work if we stood united and coordinated our powers. Their ambition blinded them to reason. I don't suffer the same affliction. In short, you can trust me. Well, that sounds like a bold-faced lie. Um, how would I think about it? 
Perhaps a demonstration of why you need my help will motivate you to make the right decision. Your camp is compromised. One among you is an imposter, a faceless. Who, I can't say. I'd suggest a thorough investigation. You'll find I speak the truth. Take that with a grain of salt. This is Gortash we're talking to. The faceless in your camp is like a knife at your throat. Remove it quickly, or any alliance between us would be exceedingly short-lived. Yeah, what was your plan? First, Orin the Red, bloody dagger of Baal, causes panic in the streets through killings in the Absolute's name. Next, the threat of the Absolute's monstrous armies formed by Merkel's general, Ketherick Thor. In such circumstances, people crave strong leaders. Leaders that bring law, order, and protection. Leaders like me, Bane's unyielding hand, author of justice. You are soon to witness the people Man, of Baldur's Gate himself. granting me complete power over them. All out of fear of the absolute. Next, I, we, will declare curfew and begin infecting the masses. Our subjects will hear the voice of their absolute god. The faithful will do anything in the name of their god. Yeah, and so it begins your tyranny. Our tyranny. And we are saviors, defenders of the Sword Coast. Our loyal subjects will love us, not hate us. What comes next will be entirely their fault. Yeah, where did you find that artifact? Powerful connections. Let's leave it at that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Am I free to go now? Soon. First, come and be witness. As I make history, the first Archduke of Baldur's Gate. Yeah, I have no interest. Then allow me to peek it for you. Ugh. Your brain twists and stretches under the Watcher's gaze. The pain almost brings you to your knees before fading. You will follow me. And you will show due respect. <sighs> Distinguished dukes, patriarchs, dearest Raven Guard, I will heed your call. A new chapter begins. Enver Gortash. Swearest thou by Baldurin's blade to defend the citizens of Baldur's Gate from enemies within and without? I swear. Swearest thou true faith and fealty to the same by word, deed, and decree so that none may suffer? I swear. Gathered guests, grant ye consent. I assume if I try to object, I'm just gonna get hurt. So Enver nothing. Gortash, <laughs> the council appoints you Archduke of Baldur's Gate. My friends, the Steel Watch stands ready. Let its blade fall on any who would diminish our city. And you, honored guest, will find me in my office above when you return. Do not come empty handed. What a show of a bitch. Oh my god, so many people! <laughs> Okie dokie. So there you have it. Lord Enver Gortash in all his glory. What did you make of him? <laughs> yeah, he seems like an absolute fraud in a very nice coat. Yeah. Fucker always had expensive taste. I don't know how anyone in this hall 
could fall for this charade. Isn't it obvious what a chancer he is? Yeah, people when they're scared will do anything to make themselves feel safe. And they expect these big metal monsters to tuck them in at night while the absolute knocks on the gates. If only they knew the truth. The Dead Three orchestrated all of this, and it's working. I wish this city, the people running it, were smarter than me. Gortash isn't their salvation. He's the monster at the gate. Can talk to people? Archduke Gortash, man of the people. The right people. You? An Archduke! Finally, someone who can stand up to those wretched absolutists. Yeah, totally. That's exactly what he's gonna do. What glory, our city. And what glory, its future. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Ravenguard has not once failed this city. If he trusts Gortash, then so do I. Yeah, he's wormed, though. Truest of souls, bathed in her light. There is a fleeting connection. Your parasite communes with his, then falls quiet. Have you come to behold the new dawn? Do the absolute bring glory. Uh, yeah, I bring here to help, help you. Help me. Ah, the Black Widow caught you in her web. Floric chose shadow over light. Her betrayal burned deeper than the fires of Avernus. She's been punished for her lies. Don't let her get to you. The Duke wants to keep Floric's location a secret. Little does he know that you've already found and freed her. <laughs> sure. What is a hero, if not an actor for the greater good? Faerun suffers in darkness. Tear has abandoned us. Helm's eye has strayed. But Baldur's Gate will soon burn bright, a beacon to light the heavens. Gortash and I will ignite the final spark, and that, true soul, is the greatest of goods. Oof. What are you naming? He is one abstained. I abstained. It was me. Me, I abstained. Finally, a leader worthy of this city. All right, so it's just a lot of people being like, I love this. Thank the living gods if Gortash is here to protect us. Yep, mm hmm, mm hmm. Okay, can't talk to you. Alright, Steel Watch, can you get out of the way? An historic day, the city's first Archduke. What's up this way? Why can't I come up here? Interesting. Down we go. Not everyone subscribes to what is mine is yours, it seems. I'm sorry, I just wanted to see if I could open up the door. I'm a freaking guest, I should be able to open all the doors. So what's the passageway? Okay, that's just back down. Okay. Right 
Okay. I guess we'll do another save real quick. Alright, Mazora. What did I tell you? A momentous occasion. I'm sure you agree. And to think the drama's just started. You see, Gortash has had Will's father relocated. Yeah, that seems fast. I'm just an impartial observer. This is Gortash's game. A murderous one, the way I hear it. Raven guards good as dead. And to think there's no way to save him. Or is there? Oh dear. All right, you're up. You know something, don't you? I know enough. Let's talk to Will in your camp. Work something out. The Duke's life depends on it. <sighs> All right, well... Anything to look at over here? Doesn't look like it. Right about those steel watches. I'm telling you. Ah, they're harmless. Except if you're a criminal. I guess we've been everywhere we can be. Should go back up to the the hall and look around. Make sure we didn't miss anything. Alright, back up. Back up we go. They pretty much won't let us go through any of the doorways, it looks like. They all got guards stationed in front of them. Okay. Did I actually talk to him again? Dearest Karlak, I'd busy myself finding Orin if I were you. I'll still be here for any unfinished business once you've secured your camp. That's it. That's all you have to say to me. Were you hoping for something else? A word of wisdom? A hug? Thanks to you, I don't hope for things anymore. I just take whatever it is I want. See you soon, motherfucker. You <laughs> certainly will. <sighs> Fine, I guess I have to go back to my camp. For all bad things to happen. Let's unlock many bad things. I brought my own paring knife. Now I just need some ingredients, and I'm gonna make something really good. I promise. Why do I have a horrible feeling it's gonna be the little girl? But please, don't look at me. <laughs> don't, don't look at me. Okay. All right, time to talk to everybody. Miss Aura. I take anything she says with a grain of salt. But with her claws as deep in our business as they are, I guess we can't ignore her completely. Anything else? What's on your mind? Oh, okay. I had no wish to lose Will. But my, it would have been nice to flush her into the colony's flesh pit. <laughs> you said there might be another way? There might be, but... Mm, it's not a path I dread until we must. 
Let it wait until the city proper. Perhaps okay. I'll have had a better idea by then. No, 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 no good idea. Okay. I don't relish the idea of Mizora visiting our camp, let alone offering us anything resembling a <laughs> deal. When the devils start approaching you, you know you're in deep. All right, Will. Your tadpole quivers, revealing your discussion with Mazora to Will. Shit. Father's been taken, and Mazora started to scheme. By all the hounds of the hells, what is she planning? She's up to no good, that's for certain. Certainly not. But she's as inevitable as Toril's path around the sun. We'll have answers soon enough. Let's talk to Mazora. Until then, may my father keep safe, whatever coop he's been flown to. Okay. A devil will come for her due. Mazora is no different. Whatever it is she comes to offer, whatever choice Will makes, someone will suffer. Count on it. Yeah, okay. Problem is, I don't think anyone's gonna mention the whole, like, there might be someone bad within our midst type thing. Whatever business Will has with Mazora, it will cost him dearly. Or worse still, it will cost us. I hope we can afford it. Okay. Mizora schemes with Will's very freedom. He deserves to know what she is up to. Will ought to know what happened with Mizora. Whatever she has in store for him can't be good. Okay. So I guess the idea is we have to do a long sleep. Hmm. Your desire. No time to rest. I guess this is the perfect time as ever to have long sleep. Swift as my feet can carry me. Let's just do another save too while we're at it. Testament. No tomb sit in Beator. No tomb sit in Beator. You've heard of such devils. Sisters of justice. Adjudicators of diabolical contracts and bargains. Holy hells. Yeah. You do not call upon the sisters. They come when the hells demand witness. Your parasite links with wills, and your memories flow into him. He sees his father's flight from Worm's Rock, and hears Mizora's words to you. Shit. Where did Gortash send my father? 
How do I save him? Sister. Infernos contractos te vocamos. Infernos contractos te vocamos. Infernos contractos te vocamos. Your contract, Will. Signed in blood, forged in fire, bound in bone, but not unbreakable. All right, what are you proposing? A life for a life. No contract is ended without sacrifice. The cost must be paid. Will Ravenguard, a choice is before you. Option one, I show you the way to your father. I guarantee him no harm except that from you and your allies. And you pledge your soul to me and the Archdevil Zariel in a pact eternal. Option two, I break your pact and you are freed from your duty. Your father dies by his enemy's hand, and Baldur's Gate loses its greatest champion. Name your sacrifice. Bloody Zariel. I won't let her take Will. Silence, Karlak. Mizora, you asshole. Choose. Yeah, what will happen to Will's powers? Addendum F. The Absolute must be avenged for the Soulbinder's detention at Moonrise. The Soulbearer retains his gifts until such time as the Absolute is slain. I could save just in case he gets real mad at me. <laughs> you damned wretch. Father. Do it. Break the pact. Fiat Ita. Fiat Ita. Anima ad beator. Didn't think you had it in you. <laughs> Seems my boy's all grown up. <laughs> and don't go fussing about your father. You made your choice. You knew the terms. You know what? I think I'll stick around. Not for the greater good, you understand. Just yeah. for the entertainment. <laughs> Okay. Darling. Okay, nothing to talk about. Hmm. I did not know Duke Ravenguard that well. But I am sure he would not want his son to become slave to Zariel for his sake. I am sure Will knows that. But we would do well to remind him when his days grow dark. Yeah, it sounds like you speak from experience. No one truly understands the weight of loss until they've worn it a while. There is no shame in sharing the load when you need to. I will. Gods, I spent seven years choked by Mazura's leash. And I spent seven years hoping to break free. I never knew freedom could taste so bittersweet. <sighs> oh. 
Well, none of these are great answers, let's be honest. Um... Oh, sorry, I had to stretch. <sighs> um... I thought you'd never regret it. I didn't. It. I don't. My sacrifice kept Baldur's Gate safe from Tiamat's rage. But that doesn't mean that the leash never chafed. That I was content to lap up whatever nonsense Mizora fed me. The leash has been broken and my father left for dead. Tomorrow I celebrate my gain. But today, I mourn my loss. A moment passes. In the stillness, you find a moat of tranquility. The Raven Guard name now lives solely with me. I will make it count for something. Yeah, there might be a way. I signed his life away before the Hell's Witnesses. It would be easier to drink the sticks down to the last drop than to alter his fate. I'd be a fool to wish otherwise. All right, then what's your next step? We obtain the final two nether stones and take back our minds and the city from the brain. Okay. Hey, lady. You just Little chilling here now? all grown up. I can't wait to see what trouble he gets into. Yeah, so that's it then, well, huh? Well, not exactly, but it's only a matter of time. Don't be too hard on Will. I'm sure he carefully weighed the pros and cons. Pro, freedom. No more pact, no more hellbound soul. Con, killing off his own father, Baldur's Gate's most beloved duke, and forever altering the city's future. I would have done the same thing in his shoes. But what do I know about heroes? Yeah, why are you sticking the around, huh? The worked a number on me at Moonrise. And you're the best hope I've got at payback. No one crosses the Hell's children without getting scorched. Yeah, you left Carla oh, alone. You are an inquisitive one. <laughs> I'd have thought you'd figured by now. Zariel found new use for an old battle axe. The dead three in that bulging brain of theirs are a threat to more than this trifling city, you know. Savor her company. Who's to say when Zariel might change her mind? My mistress can be so capricious. <laughs> Well, can you tell me about the hells? The nine hells of Beator. Each its own domain, each with its own archdevil to rule it. I call the first hell my home, Avernus, my mistress Zariel's realm, a torrid battleground split by the bloody waters of the Styx. How I adore it, the delicious agony of it all. The other eight, well, they are pleasures unto themselves. Perhaps I'll show you myself, if I deem you worthy. Yeah, you never told me how you got uh, captured by the Absolute, Correct. huh? Correct. I didn't. <laughs> if you must know, I was scouting the cultists on behalf of Zariel. But those cursed shadows were thick enough to fell even a half-fiend. I woke in that damned pod. It kept my body sealed and my most powerful magic silenced. But a brave, kind, benevolent soul set me free. Gallantry isn't dead after all. Well, if you're gonna stay, I need somebody to return. What is that? What is that going? To, I'm, I'm worried. Why? I'm supplying Will with every scrap of his infernal power. I've paid my dues many times over. 
I tell you what, when the time comes to squish that big baddie of a brain, I'll lend you a hand. All right. I don't care if you stay or not. I'll be honest. Will gave up his father to have freedom. Hmm. An understandable decision. Sacrifices must be made after all. Especially if the old duke's fall means his rise. Will sacrificed his own father. I hope freedom from the pact is worth it to him. Oh, I would like to talk. Time and again, Will's plight reinforces my decision not to pursue the path of a warlock. <laughs> it's one thing to make such a sacrifice in the pursuit of such a pact, but to do so in order to escape one. Truly, it leaves you with nothing. Will sacrificed his own father. A hard choice, but... Not one that is unknown in nature. At times a seedling must strangle the very tree that bore it, if it's to survive. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. It's hard to be like, oh, it's so horrible, because I'm like, you don't, you've not really met the character at all. And then it's like, oh yeah, he supposedly was a big hero. Like, but he's old. I pulled my own paring knife. <laughs> and now I just need some ingredients. And are you bad? I'm gonna make something really good. I promise. You a bad person. All right. I guess we just sleep. Anything else gonna happen? Seems like it. No. No, just a weird, very close shot of me. Okay. Are people gonna let us talk about, um... Hey, you. I guess not. Yes? Hmm. Okay, so she just chills over here now. Alright. end early today I'm I'm not feeling very well my brain's not functioning at its hundred percent and I'm not feeling great today <laughs> uh, so I think I might end a little early and then next time we'll go into the lower city so we've got a bunch of fun, fun things done you know Uh, let's see. Alright. But yeah, I will let you guys go find where you want to go next. Um, yeah, I'm going to end up just a little early. I'm just not feeling great. So I'm going to go chill. I'm going to go chill. Uh, I hope you all have a great day. And we'll be back tomorrow for, um... Uh, some more games with Jess. Some more farming simulator. So, I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!